But when it comes to children, up until I believe it's like eight years old or something, their nervous system is entirely reliant on their caregiver's nervous system for regulation. So they are, they are looking to you to be the leader of how to regulate. Mm -hmm. And it's not until the brain is, is formed, and it, it's not until we're 25 years old that the frontal cortex of the brain, which is that higher reasoning, decision-making, what makes us human, is actually fully formed. So maybe it is all the way up until 25 that they're, they're using the elders in the room. They're using the people that they look up to to help them find those wiser choices to start to tap in and to plug into that part of the brain. So the, the co-regulation piece and, and taking it way back to in utero, if you carry your baby and then you give birth, that baby and, and the, the person that carried the baby, their nervous systems are often deeply intertwined, like almost like the baby can't, there's no separation between like, you know, mom's heart or, or uh, you know, any, any parent can have a child, but the, pa the caregiver's uh, heartbeat then regulates the child's heartbeat and vice versa. So there's a, an intricate connection with, with who you're taking care 